Welcome to this edition of Chalk Talk. So we're still talking about defense on the six on five against the three three format for the offense. And we have a couple options here. Um, one option is where we can split the players, where we can bring these players up and gap, and then bring your bottom line up and split as well. And it's really important that this player has control of this player. If this player relaxes for a second or tries to get too into the shot blocking, one little slide or step out, the team can get a really easy goal inside. So you got to maintain physical contact here. You can help be a part of the shot blocking, but it's without getting excluded, you got to be able to use this player and get a shot block. So if we're splitting, okay, on the 5-1-6 defense, you want to make sure you practice this, this, um, this, this defense in your practices. And you can break this down into a drill where fundamentally you could say there's three players up top and two here and they need to shoot. Maybe they can't move past a certain line here. Or you could put five players up top uh, and four on defense or four players up top and three on defense and have the defenders working on their movements of going back and forth, not over committing, um, not taking those extra strokes where they get stuck and they, they can't commit. They, they can overcommit and can't cover. So um, we'll look at some drills later where we can do that. But you want to make sure you've worked on this. You don't want to just go into a certain defense and have not done the preparation before. Talk about the, the more fundamental building blocks. But now just the building blocks of a certain defense is taking it to the next level where you've worked on these techniques. Um, another option on the 3-3 on the three, three is more of a shot blocking option where you pull these players instead of coming up into the gap, they'll come back into the goal, okay? And then instead of being up high, you can come back and it's sort of, uh, you know, <clears throat> a house defense where you've got a lot of hands blocking, you've got the two goalkeeper hands, and if any shooter has the ball, you've got a number of players coming back into the cage. You can also do variations where, you know, one player is up and one player is back. There's a lot of different things as a coach that you can play with and tweak um, and find with what works for you Maybe there's a certain team that has, you know, only one or two players and you're really focusing on them. That's, that's where the fun of coaching is, is sort of taking a defense and tweaking it to make it work the best way for you.